What's up, Mavs fans? It's Maddie Clenard with Dallas Sports Fanatic, and we're here today at the American Airlines Center for Mavs Media Day. How have you been preparing for this offseason? Uh, just getting better being a point guard, finding different guys on the court, changing my speeds, learning pick and rolls, because that's all the NBA is, is pick and roll reads, and just making sure I'm more consistent with my jump shot. Um, the most important thing for me this offseason was to you know, work on my jump shot. Um, you know, I tweaked my jump shot a lot this summer, so I've just been trying to get up reps and uh, you know, make it feel comfortable. Um, honestly, just defense, my shot. Yeah. Um, just be more consistent with my shooting. And um, yeah, just you know, every, every aspect of the game, you know, you always got something to improve and you got, always got room for improvement. Um, just spending a lot of time in the gym, you know, trying my best to make sure that I'm focused and prepared for, you know, for anything that comes my way. Just working hard, I guess, you know, um, I've always worked out hard. I think that's the key to success. So um, it's going to be a different style for me here. It's going to be a different basketball, so I have to adapt to it. But the only way to do it is keep working and try to improve, you know. Yeah. Uh, I've been training hard, working on as many aspects of my game as possible and just uh, staying focused throughout the whole offseason. Uh, just staying in the gym, uh, getting in the training room, making sure my body right, yeah. things of that nature. So what aspect of your game would you say comes easiest to you? Shooting. <laughs> the shooting, scoring, it comes easier. Uh, playmaking, you know, we, we're working on it, ball handling, we're working on it. But yeah, definitely shooting and scoring. Um, probably uh, defense. Um, I bring a lot of energy to the, to the defense end, and I'm going to keep on doing that. I would say my ability to score. Getting into the paint, either creating for myself or creating for my teammates, and just putting pressure on the defense to make them work. Yeah. Blocking shots, maybe? <laughs> I don't know. Uh, like playing defense, like doing, like giving energy to the game, you know, blocking shots, taking charge, pick and roll. So, yeah, that's my game, and I've been working on it, and I will keep doing what I do best, you know? Yeah. Uh, good question. I mean, probably make the make the right play. I would say. Yeah. Yeah. Um, I'd say just making the right plays. You know, I feel like you know there are guys out there that oftentimes try and do things that doesn't really suit their game, and so I think for me, you know, I just try and go out there and, and do what I do best. It's easiest. Yeah. Um, I would say my competitive nature. Um, I like to win. Um, I hate to lose, and uh, I try to play as hard as possible to help my team uh, win on every possession. I would say it's my ability to get people involved. Like I'm coming into the NBA with a lot of really good players on my team. Yeah. So if I can if I can make them a couple points better, we could be successful. And then a little fun question for you: um, If you played Mark Cuban in a game of course, who would win? Of course, me. But uh, <laughs> I don't want to beat Boss and have Boss mad at me. So maybe I'll let him win the first one, yeah. but then I, I got to beat him after that. <laughs> me. <laughs> me, of course. <laughs> I would say I would win, but uh, you know, Mark can shoot it. We yeah. can really shoot it, yeah. Awesome. Uh, uh, I may win. Yeah. I may win. Who would win? Uh, Mark, no offense. <laughs> um, I think I would win. Yeah. But yeah, no offense, man. <laughs> yeah, hopefully me, I guess. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I've, I've seen him shooting. He's he's knocking down shots, so it's not gonna be not gonna be easy. But I should switch left hand. Maybe I have a chance, and you know. Yeah. Oh me? That's not even a question. Not, <laughs> not even, even a question. question. There's, there's, there's no question. Awesome. I think I would win, um, being a professional basketball player. Uh, <laughs> but he does spend some time on the court. And he will he will surprise you. Um, uh, he can play a little bit. I will win. <laughs> I'm gonna do all dunks <laughs> and get it over with quick. Yeah. Yeah. So, um, being from the same hometown as Dirk, how does it feel to be playing with someone who you've grown up admiring, you know, just watched play for so long? It's special. I mean, you know, I was growing up and, and he was my idol. I was watching him, you know, looking up to him. And I, I remember back then when I was young, I took a picture with him and this is like the memory I have, you know. And now being on the same team with him is just it's very special.